Hi everyone, my name is Alex. Today we will build this beautiful workflow that allow you to fulfill the form and auto-generate posts for Twitter. It works like this. We will open a form, receive a confirmation on your email, review the post, decline or approve. If you approve, for example, you will see how this post automatically appears. Here it is, testing our workflows. Let's build this pipeline step by step. Let's start from adding a form where we will input our initial data to create the posts. We don't, let's skip authentication for now. Let's call it something simple like my form please provide topic uh, optional hashtags and reference and the agent will generate platform specific posts and suggest images uh, tailored to your audience references. Here we will create a number of, of fields. First one will be topic. It's a text. Uh, it's a required field. Another form will be link to relevant materials. And another one, we will leave it optional. Keywords or hashtags optional the form responds when the workflow finishes let's test it we can see an invitation my form description we gave uh, invitation to provide a topic a link to a materials and a keyword and or hashtags we can click submit it's empty for now so let's stop it next we will create an agent for the content generation please pay attention to its prompt it will be very important Tools agent is fine. We call it social media content factory. We will define below a prompt. Don't forget to make it expression. You are a content creation AI for Alex Gurbich or me. You feel free to input uh, your name or channel name, a leading creator of agentic workflows. Your goal is to craft engaging platform specific content for Twitter. Each post must align with the platform's audience preferences, tone and style while reflecting Alex Gubich expertise. The content should provide value-driven insights, tutorials, reviews and discussions that resonate with tech professionals, automation enthusiasts, businesses and end users. Let's provide key objectives. Key objectives will be platform optimization, uh, SEO and hashtags, engagement focus, consistency and data-driven strategy. Feel free to edit this prompt for your needs. Platform-specific guidelines. For Twitter, we want to be concise and impactful in style. The tone should be crisp and engaging. Um, also, the, the tweet itself uh, should be 150 characters or less. We would like to take hashtags from the form and call to action drive quick engagement through retweets or replies for example what's your go-to ai workflow content creation workflow for every post the agent must use the following input fields topic taken from the submission form earlier keywords uh, again from the form link to that we will provide go and analyze the network resource and also adapt the tone style based on the platform guidelines above Ensure every post reflects Alec Gorbich's mission of delivering high-quality automation insights while maximizing engagement across platforms. And follow the provided JSON schema for response. Important, we need to require a specific output format. To do this, we need to connect an output parser, a structured output parser. For structured output parser, we need to define the schema below. And we should get something like this type object properties uh, description and for each pl uh, platform we describe properties for Twitter 
type, object, properties, video suggestion, image suggestion, post itself. So pay attention those to adjust suggestion. We're not automating them yet, but the post will be actual text to post as well as hashtags in the form of an array. Also pay attention, we have here a limit of characters. Let's also add here a chat model, a simple OpenAI chat model. You also can see I already have OpenAI account. I'm not creating it from scratch. Please check other videos. They're explained how to create and add OpenAI account. So now we have our social media content factory generation. We want now to send email and make sure that everything works in the way we expected. So let's add another agent. Uh, it will be a conversational agent. We will also define below its prompt. Make sure that it is an expression. So we will ask this agent to generate clean, modern HTML email content from the provided JSON data with the following requirements. Table-based layout, a card section for each platform containing title header, post, a video image suggestion, hashtag list, emoji, uh, call to action, and other requirements, including uh, like video image suggestion, hashtags, platform specific call to actions, visual quality reminders. Also, here is the requirements for input data. So this will be an input from the previous block. We will remove all code blocks and comments. Output should be in raw HTML format. Uh, we need this to show this in, in our email and we provide an example of uh, HTML for the model to follow. Make sure you have expression here. Again, we will need <clears throat> a chat model to generate. Again, same account will be enough and the simple uh, GPT for all model will be enough. Now we need to connect to these two elements. Organize a little bit our nodes. Also, make sure that this is also expression. This is important. Let's add an email node. We will need uh, Google Mail, send a message and wait for response. Resource message, Gmail account. Let me remove my existing account and let's create a new credential. Just sign into your Google account with uh, oh, oath. Yes, you allow it to do whatever is needed. Connection successful. Now we have Gmail account. Message fine. Send and wait response is fine. Two, let's send the email to ourselves. This is my email. Subject, we need an expression for approval. Social media contact factory item the generated title and description in square brackets and message will be whatever has been generated by the previous AI agent it's also expression let's set up a response type it's approval as for approval options let's provide approve and disapprove approve and decline is fine and also let's set up a time interval for a wait time limit. 45 minutes is more than enough. That's it. Let's connect a Google Mail node with our agent. We are almost there. If our content is approved, we want to post it to Twitter. So let's create if node. So if our email was approved, then we are posting it to social media. If false, we don't do anything. Now let's add a Twitter node. We need to create tweet. Let's create a Twitter account. We will need a auth redirect URL. To use it, we need to go to developer.x.com. We need to log in. As you see, I already logged in. I already have account there. Let's go to a developer portal. We have here a default project and let's create an app. Alex is contact factor. In our newly created application, we need to set up authentication settings. For the permissions, we will need read and write and direct messages. Type of the application will be web app, automated app or bot. For callback, copy this. And for the website uh, URL, we will need a URL of this workflow. Now let's save it. Copy the client ID and paste it here 
and copy client secret and paste it here save and try to connect the account you authorize your contact factory see that the connection is successful now we are good with twitter this node will receive text generated by this agent and approved by the email again this is expression from social media contact factory we will take platform post x twitter and post and let's test it immediately we see a form as a topic for the post we will take something from um, open uh, ai news recently open ai introduced codex we will write a post about codex let's copy paste a link paste link as a topic let's say um, open ai <coughs> just released a new lm codex a cloud based software engineering agent keywords or hashtags could be codex um, open ai um, chat gpt code generation ai agentic ai and let's submit it we see that our pipeline works the chat model the social media contact factory the structuring of a content was successful now the email is generated the email has been sent let's check our inbox we can see the email we expected for approval twitter post on open ai's codex release discuss the implications of open ai's new llm codex on software engineering and automation we can see here a proposed post this is a title and this is a content of the post here we have a uh, hashtags that we suggested uh, in the form and we have two buttons decline and approve that we designed in our form First, let's check my Twitter. Make sure that the last post was from March 17. Let's approve now our post, refresh the page. And we can see that six seconds ago, our content adapted to the Twitter was posted, like OpenAI just dropped Codex, a cloud-based software engineering agent. What does this mean for automation? Let's discuss. Engaging post with the hashtags that we suggested automatically posted to my Twitter. In the next videos, we will add threads, Instagram, Facebook and other social media. Stay tuned.